Hello, today we're looking at Fedora 26 Beta and as you can see, it looks beautiful. It is pure, pure GNOME on Wayland and it's truly, truly a beautiful combination. But let's have a look. If you right click on the desktop, we get these three options. Change background. Fedora only has the one background which is their own like not stock gnome and that's the one we currently have and I think it's adorable and it's absolutely stunning as you can see there is all normal gnome stuff pictures any of your pictures you can add here and colors so it's the same for the lock screen so nothing out of the world except for awesomeness Display settings As they are running the latest and the greatest of GNOME They got a night light I love night light It helps you to sleep better And I'm a big fan of sleeping better So Yes for that And of course here you can Set your monitor If you have a projector connected Or dual monitors Or modern Two monitors you can configure it here and here's the resolution. All clear, easy to understand and out of the box awesome. Settings, it's all the familiar GNOME settings. Let's just go to details. As you can see I'm running some virtual box with two gigabytes of RAM and one core of i5 processor. It is GNOME 3.22.2 I'm not exactly sure what was Valent is running on I'm trying to find out but if you know please let me know <laughs> but in general it's, it's a smooth smooth experience so if you go now to the top panel it's just a normal familiar settings like wire and Wi-Fi will be here, battery, nightlight which we just turned on, and administration. And the con settings is here you can add users, things like the talks. It's quite good. It's very quick, very responsive. Is the off button. It is the lock screen. We just press enter. Yes, it's very smooth. It's a beautiful picture of the power of GNOME and I really, really enjoy it. It's a time and yeah, you can receive all your notifications in system settings. You can con configure it there. Here's your calendar. You can add world clocks and you could add your own alarm, stop buttons, timer. It's all Awesome, and you can select location. As I'm based in St. Petersburg, Russia, I would just type sign St. Petersburg, Russia. Even though most of African, there's your weather, and then you can go to unit because I only know Celsius. And there we go. <laughs> if we go into activities, it's got a beautiful panel here. It is files 3.24.1 and Chrome Software Center. Let's go shopping. The only thing that I did not really like about this beta version because when I installed it I ran the updates I downloaded the beta version and it was like 615 updates I had to run and I downloaded it on the very in the very hour hour when it appeared on the store watch which was great for me but it's not the end of the world it all worked it's all beautiful it's just for you to know that if you, when you install the beta, just run the updates. If you go to our 
terminal, you can check out the kernel number of Linux. It's 4.11 point something 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 something. It is quite cool. As you can see, it's a very smooth, very smooth experience. Yes, maps, boxes, utilities, system monitor, let's check it out here. It is 1.4, so it's quite a lot of memory is being used. But then again, it runs very smooth, and we know that about GNOME. And if we go to weather, so tweak tool is not pre-installed, but it's easy to install. You can just time tweak, and then you can install it from the software set. I love that the packages, which is not in your computer, but in the software center, it appears when you type in the name. And yeah, I think it's a very, very smooth experience. I love it. I think they've hit the right buttons and they made an awesome, awesome version of the best of GNOME on an awesome Fedora system. I love it. I think they hit a mark and this is only the beta. I can't imagine how the stable version will be. Thank you for watching. Goodbye. See you later.